from pouring soy candles to just get her mind off of the pandemic. Yeah. Look at you, Ariana. You've got Ari's wigs yeah. here at Berwyn Shops. What does this mean to you? It's like a hobby gone rogue. I mean, for me, it just means being able to pave the way for my family, for my nieces, and just for other, you know, Latinas that, you know, it's possible if you, you know, truly put your all into it and just give it a go. Are you thinking this could turn into a brick and mortar for you eventually in Berwyn? Uh, yeah, absolutely. I also do candle workshops as well. Okay. So you uh, would need a space. Yes. So to be able to have those workshops for me, it just creates that sense of community. Uh -huh. um, so being able to have that in my space is uh, super important to me. That's wonderful. Yeah. Congratulations. All right, over here. So 12 women, all new businesses. Yeah. Tell me a little bit about like how can people come and visit? They can come visit every Friday, Saturday, uh -huh. and Sunday. So it started in May and it'll go all the way through December. So we have festivals every month, themes, events that they can do. Mm -hmm. um, and we also host musicians on site, artists on site, because we really want this to be a community space where people come and hang out and learn. Kendra, it's been so successful. I am so proud of not only all these women, but you guys, that, that it did become true. Half of the ones who participated last year have their own shop in town. Yeah, we're so excited. The Berwyn Development Corporation's team has been really proud of this project, mm -hmm. um, and we're looking forward to opening two more spaces next year. I love it. This is De Mi Tierra. Girls, you're going to love this brand because describe it for me so we are mexican inspired skincare rituals so all of our products are 100 percent natural handmade vegan no fragrance if it doesn't come from the earth we don't use it all right so for example you have flor de jamaica hand scrub yes. that's hibiscus what would this do what is the benefit of this one so it does two things it exfoliates and it also uh, moisturizes so mm -hmm. once you're done exfoliating you won't need any lotion or moisturizer afterwards you use a lot of mango as well yes. and Cactus. Cactus, mm -hmm. yes. A lot of people are surprised by this product right here. So cactuses are found throughout Latin America mm -hmm. and they have amazing moisturizing properties. So it's in English, it's called a prickly pear seed oil. Yes. Um, and this is actually one of my top, my top products. Everyone loves it um, because of its amazing moisturizing properties. What did I ask you for though? Because a Latina <laughs> who respects herself has what for skincare or any ailment? Where is your VIX? Right over here. <laughs> Robin and Lauren, I don't know about your cultures, but we swear by Vicks Vaporub, yeah. which is Vicks Vapor Rub. She makes a natural one. Yes, yeah. just like my one. I put this on before going to bed, even if I'm not sick. Yeah. Ding, 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 on your feet too, the bottom of your feet too, Anna. On your bottom of your feet, yeah. menstrual cramps, herniated discs, depression, uh, Amisha. Depression. Use your natural Vicks from the Mi Tierra. Berwyn Shops here in Berwyn, all through December, come check them out in the weekends.